A worldwide investigation reveals shrimp sold right here in the U.S. prepared with slave labor. And tonight, we dig deeper to find out if local stores are selling this particular shrimp. And new tonight, 41 Action News reporter Brian Abel shopped around the metro. Shrimp, one of America's most consumed food items. But how do you know where it comes from? That is one of the problems highlighted by a recent investigation, which found that America's supply chain of shrimp may be tainted with slave labor. Last month, the Associated Press filed trucks from Thailand processing facilities to exporting companies. Inside the trucks, shrimp peeled by adult and child slaves. The AP then cross-referenced U.S. custom records and found some of the shrimp ended up in U.S. markets. Reporters in all 50 states shopped across the country found 150 companies using the tainted shrimp, some of them with storefronts right here in the metro. Including price chopper, hy V, supermarkets like Target and Walmart, and restaurants like Capitol Grill, and Seasons 52 Fresh Grill right here on the plaza. Through phone and email, Price Chopper says it's investigating if its supplier uses the slave-run processing plants, and hy V has yet to respond with a statement. Today, Congressman Emanuel Cleaver wrote to the Secretary of Labor and the FDA, asking them to do something to stop the flow of slave-tainted seafood from Thailand and beyond. They can uh, punish these, these uh, uh, countries, uh, you know, by... Uh, you know, tr putting putting a higher tariff uh, on the the, the import of um, the importation of shrimp. But do consumers even care? Forty six percent of respondents in a forty one Action News Twitter poll say they would pay more for food processed using fair labor. Congressman Cleaver says this investigation may actually lead to something bipartisan in Congress, a new effort to change food label requirements. Reporting in Kansas City, Brian Abel, 41 Action News.